crew, piece of your action. This is the CBT guitar lesson for Robbie. Robbie, what's up? We're doing the whole Too Fast for Love album. And a great song. Dude, I can't find my slide, so I'm using a socket, as you can see, and it's kind of heavy. And uh, yeah, I'm always missing something over here, dude. You know that. So, <clears throat> mix really good on the slide stuff, man. D standard, double flat, that's our tuning. We got this build up at two seconds in, section 1A. Just an A5 power chord, open A, 2D. Use uh, dynamics, just, you know, you're gonna gradually strum harder as you're moving along. But uh, really it's just about, you know, hitting it as many times as he is. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and then down, up, down. And it's open, open on the A and D, on the down, up. And then the final down is back to the power chord, so it's, but it happens fast. Short rest, and then continue palm muting. One, two, three. And then no palm mutes on the last two. You'll be fine with that, just a big build up. Section 1B, 10 seconds in. Open A, palm mute twice. And then 7D, 9G, that's our A power chord. Just a higher inversion of it. Palm mute the open A once and move it a whole step over to 5, 7, D, and G, and that's a G power chord. Up to there. Important to keep separation between the open and the power chord, so when you hit the power chord, make sure you're touching the A string. Plus we're palm muting it, that'll, that'll help, but you want to really be able to control it with the fret hand. Two open palm mutes on the A, right back to the G power chord again twice. And then move it over two frets again to third and fifth fret. So it's okay. Open D, third fret D, pull off to open D, and then third fret A, half step bend. It's the main groove. Then it basically starts over with a different ending. Watch up to the this F power chord. Now he's going to do harmonics. So the, sec the first one goes, second one goes, and then you go back to the first one, and then most of the first one with a different ending. It'll go up. Uh, um, just a different ending. And then you'll go open three on the D, pull off open, three A, pull off open. And it's in there quick. Okay, really you need to have a slide ready or a socket. It's a little tough, dude, so bear with me on this. Um, I want it where my knuckle's gonna bend, okay? And what you wanna do, D and G string, keep that slide as flat as you can, don't push hard, and fret two, sliding up to the fifth fret. Now when you're using a slide bar, the fret wires are your actual true tonal point for a true note. So if we need fret two, we're not putting the slide bar here, we're putting it right above the actual second fret wire. What I mean is, Actually, it's a D and G string, my bad. Once you get right above fret five, it's a break. Just stop it with your hand over here. So you have, repeat it, but end on the fourth fret. Repeat it, start on the third fret. And then with this free finger over here, we're gonna go, you go, yeah. You'll do an A power chord, one, two, three. Really staccato, choppy, don't go. It's got to be. So. Then palm mute it on the last one, starting it right back over. So. Oops. Matter of fact, maybe just hit an open A so you can go. You know what I mean? You're gonna go. You know, I was thinking the secondary note was um, playing the power chord note, but now that I'm 
thinking about it, just palm mute the open A. You know what I mean? Instead of going, it's too hard to do that, and I don't think he's hitting that second fret now. But you you see how it starts with just a slide. That's section one uh, B. No, that's section one C. That comes in at 24 seconds. That lays the groundwork. After you run through that two times for section two A. So it's still the same thing, but when you on the pauses, you're gonna palm mute the open A six times. So it sounds like this. See what I mean? Uh, the end accents are the same, except on this one, the second time, no star, you'll end up going one, two, three, four, five, six, two, three, four, five. Um, then you'll go. So. Oh, one, two, three, four, five. Open D, and then we got to go seven A. Palm muted. Uh, eight times. <clears throat> so, middle finger for that, by the way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Add the index to six D. Play both strings now, palm muted. And then seven A, nine D. So you're playing around the slide bar. Um, by the way, this puts you at the top of page three. Um, no palm muting on this one. Go nine times. And he jumps over for a long slide and it goes up to around fret 12. It's like... Now you hit a big series of repeats. Basically, you go through everything again, uh, starting at 58 seconds, you know, from the... Run through the whole slide stuff again, until you get to the solo. Okay, now this is... I'm not a, a very good slide player, but I'll, I'll give you my best shot at it. 2G, slide to 5. Remember, right above the fret wires is your true note. So if we're going fret 2 to 5, starting on a fret, ending on a fret, um, it's going. Then same thing to the 4th fret. Same thing to 3rd fret. Oops. Um, you'll go... Um, three, five, two, slide to three. So it's... So you can lift the slide, of course, when you're playing. So if you don't, you're gonna get... Instead of doing that, he's going... Sliding the two to three. You get noise, because this, this is heavy, but technique with the slide, you know, if you've never used one, Robbie, it's, it's, it takes a bit of getting used to. Like I said, keep it as flat as you can across all six strings. If you don't, you get this. You'll actually hear the frets passing as you move the slide bar. Okay, um, so after we do the two to one to two. That's where it goes, so. Then, um, you start it over basically, but he's going to go higher, but start from 2 to 5, and then you can use it as a finger kind of, pick, pull to open, and pick the open, and then 5 slide to 7, has a little vibrato on it. 7D, slide down, and then strum open D and G, into 2G, slide 3, 3, 5, 2, slide to 3. 
just take that all the way down to an open. Ah. All right, um, that takes you to the 216 timestamp. Two pull off open on the G, palm mute the open D. Or you can go with this. And then you're gonna go uh, one slide to two on the G. I was forgetting the beat. 2G, pull off to open, 2D, 2G. So, 2 vibrato on the, on the G, again, and then pick, pull off, open, and then 2D, 1G, slide to 2, kind of rest it, pick, rest it, pick, slide to 1, to 2D. I'm doing it slow and it's just uh, quite different. One G slide to three. Two times slide. Open D. And then you'll see double dots. You go back and start it over from the. But the different ending. Open G. And it sounds like he does a little neck bend. That's the NB. So instead of sliding to this at the end where the star is, you're taking that off and just uh, open G. And then open D, 223 timestamp. 1G, slide to 2. Vibrato if you can. Pick, pull off to open, go to 2D, 1G, slide 2. Sounds like this. And then pick, pull, pick, pull. Open D to 2G. So it's... And I don't know, honestly, Robbie, if he's... It sounds like slide bar to me, but uh, you could go... I know he's doing... You can hear that slide. Um, second fret, two times staccato. Pick, pull open, 2D. 2G, slide three. So, sorry if you're getting lost in the explaining of it, dude. When you have your tabs, it'll make more sense. Um, top of page four, three pull off to open on the G to 2D. 226 timestamp is, um, this is fingers. So two pull open G to 2D. Three pull open G to 2D. You're gonna do that twice. You can use first and second finger. And then two pull open G, 2D. And that's gonna go twice, I, I believe. Yeah. 230 timestamp. This part reminds me of Ozzy. Slide bar 2, D, and G slide to 5, vibrato. Five slide to seven, vibrato. Seven slide to ten, vibrato. Ten slide to twelve. And if you're off the twelfth fret, just slightly, it'll be pitched off. That's what you want. Uh, 12G slide to 14 and then or, and then pull off to an open. Lead this into 17 high E. He just picks it um where is that at? It's like 14 times, but it's hard to hear the picked notes, but just kinda And then leading into this. 